Village Public School is the only one public school in Georgia, where all students are ethnic minorities and the studying process is conducted in Georgian language. School located in Tel Aviv municipality. All pupils are ethnic others. From 90s, as a necessity for the Georgian population, all Azerbaijanian classes were gradually replaced with Georgian. Today, there is only one Azerbaijanian language class in this school. Karajala is the only Azerbaijanian village in the whole Georgian surrounding. And as school director Elza Ashirova says, the language barrier is a big problem for pupils for communication. Even for writing a simple statement or for visiting doctor, they needed help of Georgian speaking peers. <laughs> Tam Ertadeti Azerbaijan, Isopelia, Katu, Garemot, Swashida, Omunicatia, Zalian, Uch Irdat, Bodesa, Sahams, if Oenar is Kartuli, Ukoment, a road shades, Leba doubt or what is Kitwa, two problem of Yakneboda, to a red crown, Yakneboda. Is having Georgian language and literature class right now. As pupils say, they love Georgian language and it's not hard to learn. The school's infrastructure and learning environment has changed during last year. The Georgian language teacher, Vera Sumbadze, says this raised pupils' motivation. Now, a great majority of them speak fluently or Georgian language. <laughs> Samira Makharova is in the 12th grade. She wants to continue studying at Tbilisi State University. She has been studying in Georgia since childhood. As Samira said, there are stereotypes about ethnic minorities, about their language skills, but it's not true anymore. Most of Azerbaijanians in this village know Georgian better than in previous years. Eight hundred students are studying at Karajala Public School now. Despite of improved learning process, there are still some major problems. They don't have gas in the village, that they use wood for heating. For students, water is available only school cafe and yard, not in the toilet and bathrooms. Also, there are two studying sheets in the school because of the number of the students and the little space available for all of them. Overcrowded classes make it ineffective for productive learning. <laughs> This room right now is very cold, despite the students are actively preparing for the competition. Apart from the language, school focuses on Georgian history, folk dance and music as well. School is now participating in the national contest Live One Day from Georgian History. They selected one day from 10th century to present on the contest. Georgian language teacher is monitoring this process. Most of the students are studying in the Gwindarum Davam Tkitsu. From Chen Arvar Tara, we see the Glebebi. We talk about the Cartel Bowships. Compared with the previous years, more high-class students are going to continue studying at the university this year. Now, seven students from Arajala Public Schools are planning to enter faculties of Tbilisi and Tel Aviv State Universities. Same class, same class, same class.